All right, today, P90X2, chest back in balance. Time to get started. Okay, so just finished up with P90X2, chest back in balance. It has been a long time since I've done this workout, and I can tell the core is not as strong as it used to be when I did this program um, consistently. Usually you have one month before you get to this workout right here, and there's a reason you do the first month, and that's to get your core prepared for like chin up, knee ups, and also lever pull-ups. Those were the two that I really struggled with today. Everything else I was able to do, maybe not as many numbers as before, but they weren't such killers. The levers and the chin-up uh, knee-ups were difficult for me today. The core was definitely taking a beating. I used to be able to do uh, 10 to 12 levers pretty easily. Today, I did eight pretty sloppy ones. I'm, I haven't seen the video yet, so I'm interested to see if any of them look good. To be honest with you, I think the butt was kind of sagging a little bit because you got to keep that core so doggone tight while you're trying to go back and forth. And I'm just not sure that the strength is there right now. So, probably something I will continue to do for the next two or three weeks just to try to get some of that core strength back. Always love mixing P90X2 in. I've done that because I've been doing a lot of P90X lately, so I thought I would challenge myself today. And even though I would do chest and back together in P90X, um, P90X2 offers the same thing, just a lot different variations. So you're going to re-challenge new muscle groups, and that's what I did today. Um, 
you know, you don't do as many push-ups per se on a day like today, but they're a lot more difficult uh, and you're using more uh, small twitch muscles than you are when you're doing just the regular push-ups because of all the stability on those uh, balls. I use these wrist guards on a day like today. The, uh, med, the med balls are really rough on the wrists, so if you're going to do this workout, I suggest getting, I don't know if these are available or not, I don't know where I got these from to be honest, they're called Grizzly Fitness wrist, band, wrist guards, and they're really nice, they kind of lock my wrists in, so it doesn't take away all the pain um, or all the problems, but it takes away a majority of it, so if I try to do this workout without them, my wrists will take an absolute beating and I'll just be not wanting to even finish the workout. So. Highly suggest that, but P90X2 is the real deal. If you've done P90X and you've not tried P90X2, you should try P90X2. It will challenge you to new levels that you've never been challenged to before with all the stability and with all the um, balance work that you have to do in this program. So, great workout today, and I may try another P90X2 tomorrow. We'll see. Depends on what, what, what kind of a mood I'm in. <laughs> all right, we'll see you tomorrow.